Hello everyone, this is Chef Perusha at Perusha's V Kitchen. I am coming to you today with another one of my good old recipes. And today we're making potato leek casserole. Now these are leeks and they are, um, you get them, you can get them from the uh, farmer's market or any mini market and you can also get them from the uh, local grocery stores. So first of all, leeks are very high in antioxidants and potassium, magnesium, and all of those good vitamins and, and different things that you need for your body. So today, we're going to make potato leek casserole. So over here, I have in my pot, I already started them to boil, is these are four kind of large medium, large medium sized potatoes. And they need to just steam for about 30 minutes because we don't want them to get over soft, but we want them to be firm enough so that, because this casserole, you bake it. And so we're gonna, um, those then been steaming a little bit already. But the leeks, one thing you have to know about the leeks is they come very tight knit. So you have to kind of wash them, you know, wash them because the way they grow, they grow down in the dirt. So because they grow down in the dirt, when you get them, you have to bust them open a little bit like this. And then you have to um, wash them all down in like that so that you get all of that, you know, dirt and stuff because we have to slice them in order to make the casserole. We have to slice them in about an inch, an inch and a half wide so that they, you know, when, when they bake, they good and soft. Okay, so I'm gonna get me a knife so we can start cutting these leeks. I hope everyone is doing well and taking care of themselves and making sure that you're taking your vitamin D and vitamin C. But we're gonna get this leek casserole started. So I washed mine really good and cut this bottom off. They really like big green onions, that's what they like. But they are very, high in iron also. So they look like this, and so we're going to slice them. We're going to get a bowl. Because we're cooking the potatoes, don't want them to get too soft. And then we're going to slightly cook these too. And, and saute them in the skillet just a little. You have to make sure that you busting them open because sometimes they're not all the way clean down inside. We don't want to use those. But the rest of these we are going to use.
and they're high in iron because you see this nice fresh green real nice green greenness that they hold so we're going to come over here I have my cast iron skillet with a little um, coconut oil in it you want to cut this on today is my meal prep day so I just been making a lot of different things I have asparagus on the meal prep today green beans I'm making this potato leek casserole and a few other nice good items to put on my meal prep you want to let that oil get hot and I think my potatoes are soft enough to come out of this pot still a little firm which is good because they're going to go in the oven and bake a little bit more so we're going to take these off because I'm going to take the skin off of them and slice them in an inch and a half slices also Just take them off and run a little water on them so they could cool off a little. Okay, so the oil has gotten hot and we're gonna saute these leeks a little bit while the potatoes are cooling. And so while the leeks are sauteing, we're just going to put a little onion powder on them and a little garlic powder. They have a little seasonings on them. So while those are sauteing, we're going to get our potatoes that have cooling off in this bowl. And we're going to peel these and slice them also in inch and a half slices. They've cooled a little. They're little, little, still a little hot, but. And they're still a little firm because the potatoes this is going in the oven then they're going to cook a little more So we're gonna cut this in half like this, and then, kinda in half, we're gonna slice it like this.
And we're gonna put them in our mixing bowl because we're gonna mix everything together in this bowl. Check back on our leeks over here. And they're cooking down nice. Don't take much heat for these to cook down. You could see them cooking down as I stir. They smell so good. And like I said, we're just cooking them down a little. I don't want them to get too soft because we're gonna stick this casserole in the oven. So that's done. We're gonna cut that off. And then we're gonna continue with these potatoes. Okay, so there you have it. We have peeled them all. Okay, so here we have our potatoes all nice and peeled, and we're gonna mix the leeks that we have sauteed in with these potatoes. And then what we do next is make a little cheese sauce. And our cheese sauce actually has nutritional yeast, sweet paprika, garlic powder. This cheese sauce has a little um, parsley in it, which we won't blend, and definitely some Himalayan salt. So, we're making this one with soy milk today. And it's just a cup of milk that we make because it's a sauce, it's not really like a thick cheese. So we use a cup of milk. get the top and so this is actually two steak tablespoons of garlic granules a tablespoon of paprika gotta get it all 
and five tablespoons of nutritional yeast. And then when we put the parsley in, we stir, we actually stir it in so that it accommodates with the uh, leeks and the potatoes. And we're gonna get our spoon so we can put a half a teaspoon of salt in it. Measuring spoons. So we're gonna put a half a tablespoon of salt in there. And then we're going to put a half a cup of oil because it still has to get a little creamy because that's what makes it really good. So we're going to blend. Uh-oh, hold on the blender. There we go. To get the power to the blender on. Okay, so. We're gonna take a half a cup of oil. And we're gonna cut this a little down on low and blend it low. Might need another half a cup. So we're gonna say a cup of oil. There we go. When you cut the cut it up a little bit on the blender so that it creams up very well. Let it blend for a minute or two. Get real nice and creamy. Okay, so this is just a, a cheese sauce. And so we're stirring and mixing our potatoes and leeks together really good. And we also gonna sprinkle just a little potatoes absorb salt really good. So we're gonna sprinkle a little black pepper and salt onto our potatoes and leeks. Okay. Just a little, little sprinkle. And a half of a teaspoon. Himalayan salt. All righty. So now, we're going to add our cheese sauce. Got that all mixed up on there. And so we're adding our cheese sauce. As you can see, it's not tight, it's loose. And you pour all of that in there. Like 
that we sprinkle our parsley in and then we mix all of this up together like that. Okay, so there you have it. It's all mixed together. And so we're going to bake it in the oven on 350 for just about 15 minutes. Y'all always catching me putting my trays out the oven. <laughs> so I'm going to get a deep baking pan because this needs to be in a deep baking pan. Y'all hold your horses while I grab while I grab the oven pan. Okay, so here you have it. And we're gonna put this in this pan. Flatten it out in here as much as you can, you know, like that. This should serve about six people. And so we're going to put this in the oven for about 15 minutes. Okay, everyone. So our leek potato casserole is ready. And so we're going to take it out the oven. <clears throat> Let's get it out this oven. Ooh -ooh. And there we have it. Doesn't that look good and scrumptious? Okay, so we have our beautiful potato leek casserole. And I just want to show y'all what it looked like. See the sauce, got the potatoes nice and done. And the leeks are nice and done. Potatoes kind of browned on the top. And there we have it, our potato leek casserole. So I want you to like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Chef Perusha. And you can get me on Facebook and Instagram at Perusha's V Kitchen. So I want you to look forward to some nice, good recipes, vegan recipes at that. So until I see you next time. Eat for life.